What's up guys? Back with another vlog. Uh, today we're gonna do just a little, what is going on? I walk backwards and there's one piece of wood in this whole place and I, I step on it. Anyways, we're doing just nothing crazy, progression obsession. It's Monday evening, just a typical Monday weekday in Ogden, Utah. Um, some of the boys are coming by. Coach Gary's gonna say, get to work, put your head down, do better. So the boys will be rolling in. Basically, I'll just, I'll just show you guys what's going on. Some of these Ogden boys are hitting off right now. I think there's like 15 homies within like a 10 mile radius that can scrape fender. So um, it's pretty cool seeing a, a big crew come together that's all like really close in a tight community. Um, and it just makes it really fun. It makes everybody progress super hard, really fast. Um, the knowledge just goes through the roof because you're not just learning from one person, you're learning from 15. So um, it really just, it helps the scene grow so much. So when they get here, I'll kind of introduce them as they ride. I don't know who all is showing up tonight. I know some people are getting their bikes worked on, some people got to work late, but whoever shows up tonight, you'll meet them. But we've got the whole summer of weekly vlogs coming up. So stay tuned. If you like what you see, go like, go subscribe, tell a friend. And uh, yeah, let's get this shit going. Oh, they're showing up. Moose, they are showing up. I knew they'd show up. Here comes Johnny G. Marcus Shores today. Isaiah. Isaiah is a young killer out here in Ogden, Utah, slaying it. Hey, youngest in the game right now. Young, are in you? Ogden. He's the youngest in Ogden right now. How old are you? 19. 19 years old. I'm going to put his handle up here, so go follow Isaiah. He just scraped Fender for the first time what? Two days ago? Two days ago. So keep your eyes out for this guy. He's going to be slaying it. Yeah. Isaiah, what's your Instagram handle? 801 Isaiah. 801 Isaiah. We've just been using the car Instagram lately. Yep, he's a he's a car boy, WRX STI, right? Yes. Yeah, sir. yeah. So go follow him if you're a car guy. Also a Harley guy. He's gonna give us a little rundown on this bad boy. So what's up, buddy? So this is my 04 FX DLI, fuel injected, as most of you guys know. Um, has a lot. It's pretty basic, but has also a lot done. Has the Legends rears, has the Legends front cartridges as well. Has the full stealth pipe crash kit. Uh, upgraded motor mounts in the front as well. Straight push to start, full handlebar, everything clean. It's pretty clean for what she is. The deep cut fender. Yeah. yeah, and he's got one of the deep, one of the deepest fenders in O Town up here in the 801 for sure. Look at that. That's a proper fender. It's a proper deepness. I like it. Clean. Anything else? Uh, lucky day of seat. Just about that. Oh, maybe about uh, La Para? Oh, it's La Para. Hey, it's a clean seat. It's a clean seat. It's almost seat. not time for a saddle. She, I don't know, dude. La Paras are pretty nice seats, bro. Oh, I get it. It keeps me in there, so that's not matter. I don't have to say anything nice about Saddlemen because they don't sponsor me, so yeah. honestly, I think the La Paras are nicer than the Saddlemen's. Hey, when Saddlemen sponsored, you know? If I was Saddlemen nice. sponsored, I'd be like, whoa, La Paras are garbage. But honestly, La Para, with non-biased opinion, the pairs are solid. Worked out well for me, man. It's the build up for the pace. Sick. Well, good to meet you, buddy. And uh, we'll get some shots of you ripping. And you'll watch this dude progress all summer because he's going to be around. So go give him a follow. All right. Take two. This is Johnny G. How you doing, Johnny? How's it going? Doing good, good. We're going to do a quick bike rundown on this dude. Tell us a little bit about yourself, who you are, where'd you come from, and how'd you get in the Harleys? Oh, well, I'm originally from New Mexico. My lady brought me out here to Utah, and then uh, me and Gary start, started working together. Seen him wheelie a Harley, and I came from Moto as my background, and uh, it's just, I was like, there's no way this guy's wheeling a Harley. So, you know, he talked me into getting this nice Evo, this 1994 convertible. Thing's badass, I love it. Has a little bit of work done to it. So, uh, dude, I have no idea what's done to this bike, to be honest with you. Johnny doesn't know much. Well, what if you had to fix on it? So that's oh. one thing you'd know that's done. 
I had to fix a lot of oil leaks. <laughs> I had to fix my uh, sprocket, my drive sprocket came loose on me. It was like making a weird noise, had to fix that. Um, What'd you do to the frame? They don't come stock that color. Yeah, they do. This one did. It did? Yeah. The 94s came special edition stock silver frame? Oh, yeah. Well, we took the motor out, powder coated the frame, and, uh, you know, put an ignition on her. It's a custom exhaust. Someone made the headers and then just got a little slip on. So that thing's sweet. Sounds vicious. It does sound vicious. Oh yeah, I got a big uh, boy cam in there. These bad boys, you started riding a lot better once you threw some good suspension on there. Yeah, there's, these guys are stiff. I like stiff, <laughs> I like stiff. These guys are stiff. Definitely have to get used to uh, doing that. Oh, got the back fender. Mm. Got a Looks like you smashed city. it pretty good. <laughs> uh, come on. Come on, man. Oh, uh, oh. That's it, huh? Yeah, that's pretty much it. I don't know much. I just ride the thing. He's really good at riding it, though. We'll put in some clips of Johnny riding this bad boy and doing what he does best. If it, don't, it ain't hardly if it don't leak, I'll tell you that, though. Yep. Yo, this bird is stuck in one spot. <laughs> what in the world? It's trying to fly so hard. It's a hoverbird. <laughs> <laughs> it's a hoverbird. He's trying tough. Like that bird doesn't have a problem. That's a bird duck. Yo, that bird is stuck. Where'd he go? Oh, he's gliding now. Oh, he's... Oh. Poor bird, he's stuck. He's gonna run out of energy. He's Crash landing. Smack the lip. Crash landing. <laughs> All right, this is another O-Town hitter, Riley Green. I'll pop his Instagram up on the screen. Um, but Riley, you just learned how to scrape what? How long ago? Yesterday. Yesterday, so. Yeah, another Ogden hitter. Super clean bike. What year is this bad boy? It's a 99 FX DX. Um, I know you're gonna ask to do the rundown on it, but I can't really take credit for any of this stuff that's done to it besides the paint. Uh, this is Jarek's old bike, you know, Jarek from Pit Biker. Yeah, cool Jarek Peterson used to own this bike. Um, he, he put on the exhaust, he did the brakes, he, he did, did the suspension, he did everything, but Riley, he can absolutely take credit for doing this uh, paint work. And if you guys it's are out there, nasty. it's dirty right now, but it's a super clean paint job. Just an OEM style with a little touch of style. But he absolutely killed it on this paint job. So if you're in Utah or the surrounding states and you want some uh, paint work done, this is your dude, uh, Riley Green. And he's an absolute killer. You'll be seeing him in the vlogs. Um, he'll be hanging around and absolutely out there getting it so <laughs> let's get it baby all right this is my boy ryan james he's a sporty he's a sporty boy in the group i talk a lot of shit on the sporty boys but ryan's a solid character i love the dude so um one of the most fastest progressing homies in utah at the moment right now at the beginning beginning of winter this dude could barely willy a grom and You'll see what, what he can do here in a little bit. So, Ryan, who are you? What's up, buddy? I'm Ryan James. I'm from Lane, Utah. Never grew up riding. I started riding in 2021. Bought this bad boy in 2021. I wanted to stunt Harleys because I saw Gary at the Hive Crew show. <laughs> Thanks, dog. Hell yeah, I appreciate <laughs> that, dude. That, that honestly, that makes me stoked that I motivate people to get out here and rip because that's honestly what life's about. Life's about being born, learning as much as you can and passing it all along to the next the next people. So that's awesome, bro. I appreciate that. Oh yeah. Um, but yeah, absolute killer. Um, you want to give us a quick rundown what you've done to the thing? Yeah, what yeah, your plans sure. for the future? So I got Dynamite Crew, Bars and Risers, 8 inch pullback. Pull back and then what just like a mid bend is that a mid bend bar yeah mid bend bar sick with the one finger levers gotta have the one fingers on there make it easy gotta have the saddle man see made by sporty mob sick shout out sporty mob big supporters out here in utah sporty mob big supporters i got the reckless step plate and i got the bung king Squish play with the titanium from Scrape City. Scrape shit. Scra Scrape City. Shout out Kevin, baby. Scrape City. Um, what exhaust is this? Oh, I got the SPC Concepts exhaust on it. Sick. Super clean setup. Love it. Really nice exhaust. Chain conversion kit. What suspension you running? 
We're running the drag specialties, 13 inch. 13 inch drags. And then anything, anything in the front or stock front end? Stock front end. Bone stock front end. Yeah. Um, sick. He's out here killing it. Killing it on this thing though. Set up for set up for stunt and this thing's got protection. He can lay it down. How many times has Ryan James gone down in the past like three months? Grom and Harley. Grom and Harley. Oh, Hard too. Like this dude that's, takes hits, bro. That's a tough one. It's got to be more than 10, 20. <laughs> yeah, for sure. <laughs> that's what I love about Ryan is he falls down and he gets back up. And he, that's the reason why he's progressed so fast. And you guys will see here in a little bit. Mind you. In like December, this dude couldn't wheelie a Grom for shit. <laughs> and now you'll see what he's doing on the Harley. It's pretty cool. So thanks, Ryan. Appreciate you. You'll be seeing Ryan a lot this summer. He's going to be riding with the Hive Crew boys, myself, and uh, all the Ogden boys. So. Lot dog. Moose, are you the lot dog? Good boy. That's the lot dog, Moose. So cool to just be able to come out on a weekday and shred with homies, progress, obsess, progression, progression, obsession, baby. Um, but yeah, it's crazy because a couple of years ago, this was never a thing. Like, there was never a bunch of homies out here just ripping. We had to drive an hour on the weekends to link up with a boy. We had to drive an hour on the weekends to, to link up with whoever was trying to stunt. So, this is this is a whole new game. We're pretty stoked on it. So, Let's get it. Let's get a couple shots of these boys. I'm gonna hold them to a high standard out here. I'll tell you that. Slow boys. Slow boys. Oh. Let's see a sick trick, Johnny.
guys so thanks for tuning in thanks for watching um this vlog was nothing too crazy it was no crazy big event no nothing too special um just kind of a day in life around here on a on a weekday monday monday evening you know um i'm stoked on the crew we got coming up here in here in ogden like i said we've we have about 15 homies that can like scrape fender on harleys and uh what i want to do is i want to get all those guys camera time i want to do breakdown on all their bikes um, get some character development so you guys know here watching um, you can watch their style progress and you can see these boys just come up you know it's really cool to watch so um, on that note um, we have uh, the swarm coming up in 10 days from the when this video drops it's gonna be 10 days away um, it's a week from Friday coming up so May 26th through the 29th go book your Airbnbs book the hotels Tell your friends, load the trucks, get the bikes dialed because you're not gonna wanna miss this. It's gonna be so sick. Um, Swarm part two, it's the second year and we're planning on doing them every single year. So we hope that it only grows and gets better every year. It's gonna be one of the ones that you don't wanna miss. We're pretty centralized uh, to everybody, Arizona, Nevada, California, Oregon, Washington, even the Canada boys come down. Um, so everybody's gonna be here. And uh, if you're watching this, load up. We'll see you guys there. Go get it.